Tumpung is a cone-shaped rice dish with side dishes of vegetables and meat. Traditionally featured in the Slamatan ceremony, the rice is made by using a cone-shaped woven bamboo container. The rice itself may be plain steamed rice, uduk rice cooked with coconut milk, or yellow rice, uduk rice colored with kunyat turmeric. The rice cone is erected in the tampa, rounded woven bamboo container, covered with a banana leaf, and surrounded by assorted Indonesian dishes. In 2013, the Indonesian Ministry of Tourism and Creative Economy promoted Tumpung as one of 30 Indonesian culinary icons and gave it the status of official national dish of Indonesia in 2014, describing it as the dish that binds the diversity of Indonesian various culinary traditions. History and tradition People in Java, Bali and Madura usually make tumpung to celebrate important events. However, all Indonesians are familiar with tumpung. The philosophy of tumpung is related to the geographical condition of Indonesia, especially Java as fertile island with numerous mountains and volcanoes. Tumpung dates back to ancient Indonesian tradition that revered mountains as the abode of Hyangs, the spirit of ancestors and gods. The cone-shaped rice meant to mimics the holy mountain. The feast served as a thanksgiving for the abundance of harvest or any other blessings. Tumpung is a symbol of gratitude. In gratitude ceremony, Sayakoran or Slamidan, after the people pray, the top of Tumpung is cut and delivered to the most important person. He or she may be the group leader, the oldest person, or the beloved one. Then, all people in the ceremony enjoy the Tumpung together. With Tumpung, people express the gratitude to God and appreciate togetherness and harmony. An annual ceremony involving tumpung is commonly called tumungan. In modern times, the top of the tumpung is given to an honored guest in social events, ceremonies or awards. In many Indonesian cities, such as Yogyakarta, a tradition has been developed. The tumungan ceremony the eve of 17 August, which is Indonesian Independence Day. The event is meant to pray for safety and welfare of the nation. Surrounding dishes The cone-shaped rice is surrounded by assorted Indonesian dishes, such as urap vegetables, ayam goreng, fried chicken, ayam bakar, grilled chicken, ample gepuk, sweet and spicy fried beef, aban sapi beef floss, samor, beef stew in sweet soy sauce, teri kakang, anchovy with peanuts, fried prawn, teller pindang, boiled marble egg, shredded omelet, tempe auric, sweet and dry fried tempeh, per kettle kentang, mashed potato fritters, per kettle jagging, corn fritters, sambal goreng ati, liver and chili sauce, and many other things. Traditionally there should be a balance between vegetables, egg, meat, and seafood. The composition of a traditional Javanese tumpung is more complex because the elements must balance one another according to Javanese belief. Traditional Javanese tumpung usually involves urap vegetables, tempeh, ayam goreng, teri kakang, fried shrimp, teller pindang, empal gepuk and sambal. After the adoption of tumpung as the national dish, tumpung is expected to be a dish that binds Indonesia's cooking traditions. Its side dishes might be popular Indonesian dishes, such as gado gado, satay and rendang. Today the dishes which accompany tumpung can be of the host's discretion. Philosophical meaning there is a philosophical meaning on every part of traditional tumpung. According to folklore in Java and Bali, the cone-shaped tumpung is a mystic symbol of life and ecosystems. It also symbolizes the glory of God as the creator of nature, and the side dishes and vegetables represent the life and harmony of nature. The authentic and complete tumpung dishes should contain at least one meat to represent a land animal, fish to represent sea creatures, an egg to represent winged beasts, and vegetables that represent a food stock provided by the plant kingdom. Usually tumpung is served with spinach as spinach is a traditional symbol of prosperity in Javanese agricultural society. Here are the philosophical meanings behind some of the ingredients in tumpung. Egg. The egg is served with the shell still on. Peeling the egg before eating it symbolizes everything a person has to plan and do before becoming a good person. Vegetables, a wrap of vegetables represents a good relationship with friends and neighbors. 
Spinach represents a safe and peaceful life, water spinach represents a person who could live through hardships, string beans represent a long life, and mungbean sprouts represent carrying ancestors' legacy. Catfish, catfish represents the importance of preparing for troubles in the future. It also represents being humble, since catfish live on the bottom of ponds. Milkfish, the many bones of the milkfish represent good fortune and prosperity in the future. Anchovies, because they live together, the anchovies represent having a good relationship with family and neighbors. Variations There are several variants of tumpung, differentiated according to the ceremonies. Tumpung Rabyung This kind of tumpung usually served in the traditional Javanese siraman, bridal shower, ceremony. Tumpung is placed on bakul bamboo rice container, egg, shrimp paste, shallots and red chili are placed on top. Tumpung Nuja Bulan This kind of tumpung is served in the seventh month of pregnancy, prenatal ceremony. Tumpung is made of plain white rice. A main tumpung is surrounded by six smaller tumpung. All tumpungs are erected on tampa covered with banana leaf. Tumpung punkert Used in the ceremony for the death of a virgin or unmarried male or female. It is made from white rice surrounded only with vegetables dishes. The tumpung later must be cut vertical into two parts evenly and placed one against another. Tumpung pudo White tumpung, uses white rice since white symbolizes holiness in Javanese culture. This kind of tumpung is employed in sacred ceremonies. Tumpung nasi kuning Yellow tumpung, the color yellow represents gold, wealth, abundance, and high morals. This kind of tumpung is employed in cheerful and happy festivities and celebrations, such as celebration of birth, engagement, marriage, Eid, Christmas, etc. Tumpung nasi uduk, also called tumpung tasayakaran. The uduk rice, rice cooked in coconut milk, employed in the Malad Nabi ceremony, celebrating the birthday of Prophet Muhammad. Tumpung ceremonial, modificasi. This contemporary tumpung is relatively more open for modifications and adaptations. It depends on the discretion, taste, and request of the host. Contemporary tradition Today, most Indonesians serve tumpung as a dish to celebrate a special occasion, such as a birthday party, arisan, family or neighborhood gathering, farewell party, celebrations, recitals, and many other joyous events. Because of its festive and celebration value, up until now tumpung sometimes seen as an Indonesian counterpart of birthday cake. Tumpung contests are sometimes held to commemorate Indonesian Independence Day in August 17 or to commemorate Women's Emancipation Day, the Kartini in April 21. The tumpungs in this contest are judged by decoration and taste. According to Jati in local wisdom behind Tumpung as an icon of Indonesian traditional cuisine, in 2004, the Republic of Indonesia's Ministry of Health rolled out a Tumpung-based food pyramid to encourage healthy eating because Tumpung includes samples of food from every food group. The meat or soy-based sides provide iron, zinc, and protein, the vegetable side dishes provide vitamins and minerals. In 2009 Garuda Indonesia started offering mini NASI Tumpung Nusantara as part of its new concept to highlight Indonesia's hospitality. Tumpung is offered in Indonesian restaurants abroad, such as in neighboring Singapore and the Netherlands, the building of Suharto. S. Purna Bhakti Pertiwi Museum in Taman Mini Indonesia Inda, Jakarta, took shape of Tumpung. See also Javanese cuisine Javanese culture Indonesian cuisine List of rice dishes Rice References External links In Indonesian, Recep Nasi Tumpung in Indonesian, tips NASI Tumpung Lezit. 
in English, NASI Tumpung, its meaning and function. In English, philosophical meaning of Tumpung. <laughs>